the 1962 Tournament of Champions. Palmer curled into the hole for a sensational 33. The champion of champions, Tom Watson. And a great win for Lee Ravino to Mary Max. For the 12th time, Phil Mickelson, a winner on the PGA Tour. It was a clear sunny day in Southern Cal. It had been no problem. When I first stepped on the tee, the nerves started to fly a little bit because then I had to hit. I knew that if I hit my shot that I've been hitting all week, it shouldn't end up just right of the hole. And uh, it ended up just that. Well, that's uh, fairly convincing, would you say? There's no better place than Kapalua. I love playing Hawaii. Great way to start the year. It's the perfect place. He's gotten me before, and I've gotten him. So it's, it's been a, a nice little tug we've had together. It was a lot of fun, I'm telling you, to be able to step up there on 18, and I, I rip one down there on the green and have a chance for eagle, and he puts it right inside of me. I bury it, he buries it, and we go back up. I make birdie, he makes birdie. We go to playoff, the second hole in the playoff. What do you think about that? I make my putt, and he just leaves dead in the middle. I've had some good weeks in my career. Just another eagle for any else. To shoot 31 under par, obviously I, I haven't done that. Uh, nobody's done it. Yet, so. <laughs> Stuart Appleby, the winner of the 2004 Mercedes Championships. To know that when you've won that event, you're straight back there next year. It is nice to have locked that return visit back in. It appears they may rename the Mercedes Championships the Appleby Championships. Stuart Appleby wins his third straight Mercedes Championships. First time great, second time awesome, third time, it's the wrong English, but more awesomer.